Good morning. For the second time in 24 hours, Prime Minister Kevin Rudd has warned of the havoc the global economic crisis will have on jobs in Australia. In a speech in Adelaide, Mr Rudd tried to be optimistic. He said Australians can get through this tough time if we make sacrifices, like forego a pay rise, in order to rebuild jobs. It came after the human casualties of the slowdown emerged. The construction industry warned 50,000 jobs were at risk, while a big Sydney retailer began shedding staff. To the national weather for today, and it should be fine for most capitals. In Sydney, we can expect showers or a possible thunderstorm. We'll now return to our live ABC coverage of the inauguration of Barack Obama. Have a great day. We'll have more news coming up shortly. Goodbye. You're looking at pictures of Blair House. We're expecting the president-elect and Mrs. Obama to leave shortly for their trip to St. John's Church nearby, which is called the Church of the Presidents. And FDR went there. Franklin Roosevelt went there at a time that the nation had 5,000 banks shut down, one out of three people unemployed. He went there to pray before his service. Five Republican, five Democratic presidents have been there.